Hello everyone, in this video we will learn how to automate Facebook post with OpenAI. So we are going to learn first of all how to integrate these three applications that is scheduled by Pabli with OpenAI and then OpenAI with Facebook in such a way that you can get the opportunity to create a new Facebook post on your page every day. For that we are going to put schedule by Pabli, then we are going to generate content using OpenAI and then finally we will post it on our Facebook page. This automation we are going to create with the help of Pabli connect and here our trigger will be first the trigger every day by schedule and then our first action will be to generate content using OpenAI and then our last action will be to create a page post in Facebook. Let us learn how to do that. So in this video we will learn how can you create a post on your Facebook page automatically and also generate the content regarding the post using OpenAI. Let us quickly sign in into our automation software Pabli so that I will reach this place where I can see all the applications provided by Pabli. Here we are going to use Pabli Connect to create the automation. Click on access now, which will take me to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Reaching here, you will see a big blue button on your right side where it's written create workflow. Click on the button and give a suitable name to your workflow. I'm going to name it as automate Facebook post with open AI. Click on create and then a blank workflow will be created for you like you can see on your screen. You will see trigger and action two windows over here. Trigger says when this happens and action says do this. Now make sure that you've opened your Facebook page over here and select the page like going from this left panel to your pages and select the page from wherever you want to create a post. For example, I want to create a post on Pabli Connect. Now this is my page and I want to create a post over here. So let us choose our trigger application. First of all, the workflow will go as I create post on my Facebook page about dates and their significance. So I want to schedule first of all that every day the, a post should be created. For scheduling, I will use a feature by Pabli called schedule. With the help of this feature, you can actually set the working of this workflow once every day or any specific day of the week, any specific date of the month or at regular intervals. I want my post to be created every day. So I will choose this option and I will set a time as well. So you can choose the time. For example, I will choose the time as 12 p.m. So this is the time of my post. Every day at 12 p.m. a post will be created. This workflow will start running. Click on save first of all. And here is the date that has been fixed. Now further, now further, we want the current date as well because I am working upon the significance of any specific date. So I want to create a post on every day significance. So I will choose over here date time formatter. Now again date time formatter is a feature that is built inside Pabli and is used to format the date, add, subtract and also to take out the current date as well. So every day at 12 p.m. when this workflow will start running, this date time formatter will detect the current date that is date of that specific day. Click on connect. Now again no specific way of connection is required because this is built inside Pabli itself. Now what is the format of the date that I want? A simple format and I don't want the time in the response as well. Click on save and send test request and here is today's date that we have received. Now I have received the date as the year, month and date format but I don't want to mention the year while generating content with the help of OpenAI because since OpenAI will detect the date also so it will say that I cannot predict the future and so on. So in that case I just want the month and date and find the significance of this specific date. Alright, no year should be required. For this reason I will be using the next step as text formatter over here. Now text formatter again is a feature that is built inside Pabli and it is used to format, split, replace or find or extract pattern in the text. So we are going to split the text to split this date like date separate, month separate and year separate. So for that purpose first connect and now you will map over here the date or the text that you want to split. So we are going to take the response from the date time formatter this. So you want this date to be splitted. How it can be splitted? With the help of these hyphens. So the way the hyphens have separated the month, date and year in the same way you want separate values for the month, date and year. So the separator we are going to use is the hyphen. And which segment do you want? I want all the segments because I want the month also, the date also and the year as well. Click on save and send test request. Now since we have received the year, month and date separately, we are not going to use year over here. We just need the month and the date. So we are going to use this when we will be creating a prompt in our open AI. So then comes our next action application that is open AI. 
choose your application and the event will be generate content we need to generate a content about the significance of this date that we have just now received in the response click on connect add new connection and go to your open ai api keys page because you would need a token over here to connect your public connect and open ai click on this button if you've already logged in into your account so you will reach this api keys page click on this new secret key and give a name to your key i'm going to write as facebook posts click on create secret key and you will receive this key copy this and paste it over here click on save and open ai and public connect will be connected the basis of this connection is that whatever prompt you will be giving will include some of the details that you will be taking from these previous steps of the workflow and that is why we have established this connection now you have to select the ai model now this is the most used model that is text da vinci 003 and you're supposed to use this one only you will give a prompt over here the command which will generate the content now you can understand all these things by going over here to the playground in your open ai api app you will see this is a playground where you can manually generate the content with the help of open ai and here all these functions are given all these filters are given which you can put into use while generating this content so similarly they are over here now tokens means the maximum number of words i am not going to provide any token over here because this that will limit the data and might not be able to complete the sentences as well but it's not a mandatory field so you can leave it empty and the default value will be set to 256 okay select sampling type so there are two types of sampling nucleus sampling and temperature sampling so you are going to use temperature sampling for the same now sampling value presence penalty frequency penalty are all the filters you need to put to your text i am not going to dive deeper into these functions because you can understand all of these uses by visiting our youtube channel and find a video how can you set these settings of open ai in public connect right now i'm just simply going to give a prompt i will give the prompt as write a short facebook post on the significance of this date and i will map the date from the text formatter first take the date put a slash and then the month once this is done put a full stop and your prompt is ready we will simply come down here and click on save and send test request you have received an id over here in the response and here is the text all right so this is the content that has been created with the help of open ai now we are going to use this to create a post on our facebook page so let us close this and then map these data that you have generated from open ai in your facebook page so choose your last action application as facebook now there might be many applications related to facebook but we are going to choose facebook pages click on facebook pages and the event will be create a page post creates a new post to your page click on connect add new connection as i mentioned earlier you need to open your facebook page right here so it will be easier for public connect to detect your account click on connect with facebook pages now click on continue if this is the account you're working upon and continue as the name of your account once this is done the connection is successful now you can use the previous step data to generate a post in your action application now choose your page as i mentioned that the public connect name is the page that i want to create a post to so i will select public connect over here and then here i will enter the message so the message we have received from open ai will be pasted over here it's mapped over here so every time a new date is entered over here in your current date it will be formatted then according to the significance of the date the content will be generated and that will be mapped over here is there any link that you want to paste no and it's not a mandatory field you have selected the mandatory field and set the settings so now just click on save and send test request and wait for the response from facebook and here we have received a response with an id of the newly created post over here which means if it shows no error so the post has been created close this window and let us go to facebook to check our newly created post about today's date So this is our page public connect and you can see that we have just now created a post with happy hashtag world environment day and this was the content that was generated by us using open ai 
so which means that the post has been created and every day a new date will be detected over here and a new content will be generated which will be posted on your Facebook page Pabli Connect. So this was the whole workflow. I hope this helped. Not just these applications, but you can integrate many other applications using Pabli Connect. If you have any issue regarding Pabli, you can email us at support at pabli.com. You can ask your queries at forum.pabli.com. And if you have any doubts regarding our pricing, then you can connect us through this given website. If you found this video helpful in any way, then make sure to share this with your friends and colleagues to make their life easier by creating automations. We will meet in the next video. Till then, do not forget to like our video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.